Hey, Messy Cook fans. It's the Messy Cook here. Today, I'm outside on this beautiful Monday evening, and I'm going to show you a recipe uh, that I'm going to attempt on my new Blackstone griddle. Oh, I love this thing. You'll love it too if you ever get one, but I'm going to make some bourbon chicken. Uh, it's pretty easy, and um, we'll just uh, we'll get going. Okay, we've got the beautiful Blackstone here. And there's the messy dog already looking for scraps. So we're going to get this puppy fired up and get it uh, warmed up. Here we go. Okay, while our Blackstone is uh, warming up, we've got slot thinly sliced chicken and we've got about two tablespoons of cornstarch mixed in with that we've got peppers and onions diced up to bite-sized pieces and then we have our sauce which consists of soy sauce uh, chicken stock some ketchup some bourbon some brown sugar um, um, uh, garlic diced garlic and we have um, a teaspoon of sriracha in there and we're gonna put all this on the grill and get it going I almost forgot in this sauce there's also a quarter cup of apple juice and a tablespoon of apple cider vinegar. Okay gang, I'm going to try to do this with one hand. So I've got some pure sesame oil. That's what I'm going to do on put this on the grill here because that's the best kind of oil to use when you're cooking a chicken dish. Okay, we're going to get that nice and spread around. And then we're going to take our marinated chicken. That's going to go right on the grill. Okay. Get that all spread out. We're cooking on one side. Turn these up just a little bit. Get some more heat. And let that cook for about a couple minutes on that side. Then we're going to flip it. We're going to add our vegetables. Cook those a little bit. Add the sauce. And we're going to add some bourbon chicken. Okay, the chicken doesn't take long to cook on here. So now I'm going to flip it from one side. You don't want to cook it all the way through yet. Because we've still got our vegetables to add. Beautiful seasoned griddle. Nothing sticks to it. Okay, and let that cook just a tiny bit more. So the chicken is nice and cut thin strips, so it's going to cook fairly quickly. But we're going to finish cooking it while we're also doing our veggies. Okay, what we've got here is actually two pounds of uh, thinly sliced chicken. We got four green peppers and one onion diced into bite-sized pieces. Now that that chicken's cooked some more on the other side, we're going to add these veggies, wonderful veggies, and we're going to get that all cooking together. I'm going to cook these, cook this now until the veggies are starting to get soft. We don't want, we don't want them limp. We want them to be, we still have some crunch. And once that is done, we're going to add our sauce. I'm going to add a little bit more oil to the top. And I'm actually going to close the top and let that cook. While that's cooking, we play catch with the messy dog. Come on, Kobe. Come on. Bring it back. Now bring it back like a good dog. Drop the ball. No, get. No, how can I? Kobe, I can't throw. Kobe, I can't throw it. Come on. Get back. Okay, all right. Oh, 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 okay. Oh, he got the, I guess he doesn't want me to throw it. Okay, go have fun. Okay, now that our veggies are starting to get a little tender, we're going to take our sauce. And we're just going to pour that all into the chicken. Oh, yeah. Sauce that all. That's going to thicken up a little bit as it cooks down, plus the, the cornstarch that was on the chicken. It's also going to help it thicken up a little bit. Oh, that looks so good. 
and keep tossing that over and over. You can see it's thickening on the edges already. I'm gonna keep that here on the griddle. So again, I'm going to turn it up just a little bit. I think my griddle is a little bit on its slant. I'll have to take care of that, but that's all right. We got this nice tossed here. Finish that up. Oh, there it is. Looking really good. Let's see Cook's going to try this right off the grill. Oh, God, it looks so good. Oh my goodness. You have to try this. It is double excellent. 